Bob, Dan, if I saw this when I grew up, <laughs> if you showed me this shit when I was like four or whatever, when this came out in Japan, yeah, I would have lost it. <laughs> Yeah, no, this is insane for this, that time. Good lord. This is the level of cool that earns your loyalty to a platform until it bursts into flames. <laughs> I love Sonic the Hedgehog, but Sonic the Hedgehog isn't as cool as Rondo of Blood. <laughs> no, it's really hard to be this cool. Honestly, like, seeing a lot of the PC Engine library, like, oh, wow, that was surprisingly good. Yes. I wish that we got a better release of it in the States, because I didn't even know it existed in the States until... Until way later. Yeah, way later. I saw it in magazines, but that was it. I figured our area didn't have it because we weren't cool. Turns out no one had it. <laughs> also, like, New Jersey had it. I don't... <laughs> I can't confirm anything else. <laughs> they, they should not have redesigned it physically. Good lord. <laughs> it's, it's clunky. That redesign looks terrible. Is just awful. Like you could defend the NES design, you cannot defend the Turbo Graphics design. It's real bad. Right. But I, I think, from a modern perspective, uh huh. I think it looks neat to have that version because it is the original. You know. I, I can't even. I can't even get behind that. Run button. <laughs> okay, so I was six when this came, but still, that's like mind blowing. New file. Yes, Here we you go. wanna you wanna definitely do that. In order to do that, oh, you right. need to do name entry. name entry. Boo? Boo? There we go. Now you need to end. And now I can start it. Yeah. And now you can game start or technic. Technic. Do you need to know how to fight death? That's zero dollars. Okay, okay, that's kind of sad, but here you go, kid. I didn't think it would load a video. Oh, well, yeah. Yeah, it's showing you how to... I mean, it's not a video. It's it's literally pre-programmed the game to fight oh death God. effectively. Okay, okay, we don't need to do this. Yeah, I'm the, sorry, they did that. Ag they did that again in uh, Symphony of the Night, too. I I thought Symphony just had a tech description of something about the boss, because that's what I, I expected. It's like, here's some weird little hint. <laughs> Here's some weird little hint. This just says F you. <laughs> Bye. Very cool. But yeah, no, if I if I got the PC engine, yeah. played China Warrior in this, I'd be like, well. <laughs> You're like, who needs a Super Nintendo? That <laughs> doesn't have China Warrior. See that guy? That's how big the dude from China Warrior is. <laughs> yeah. Here's all your stupid platforming characters running from him because he's so huge. <laughs> the ideal upgrade, uh, Genesis to PC Engine. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think chronologically that's backwards, but you still might be right. I don't know. <laughs> I do like the sound of the PC engine more. Yeah, personally, there are some people who could do amazing work on the Genesis. For sure, they are not most people. Right. There's a lot of good sounding stuff and a lot of really bad sounding stuff. Yeah. Now loading. Okay. okay, there we go. <laughs> That's a really good PCM sample. It's so high quality. Yeah, this is a CD game, so I. Yes. But the music is still made using PC Engine hardware. Uh, no, the music, the music. Right now, we're just doing ambience. Yeah. Uh, but the music CD audio. Okay, okay. That's how it's that amazing. Right. You're controlling. Oh. Uh oh, maybe you should have watched that video. This maybe. is this is going rough. Not sure we're gonna make it through this uh, level, you guys. <laughs> hey, Bob. Hey, <laughs> this, this is you're rough. making me look good at Super Metroid right now. Yes. Thank you. I appreciate. It. Oh my god. This oh is, my god, Bob. This is the worst it's ever been. There we okay, go. Okay, there you go. Now you got to do a cool flip to dodge this technique. Are you ready? I'm not sure that standing right next to the boss is. Oh man, yeah, you it's... got so close to dying. <laughs> <laughs> I think actually just standing all the way forward, if I'd done that, it wouldn't have been hit. Yeah, maybe. I usually do a cool backflip from the back of the carriage, because, <laughs> you know, it's always good to show off the backflip. Not a lot of people know that, you know, Richter's a fucking badass. 
Look at that. Good, I don't take the health from the last level. That would have been uh, bad. <laughs> I feel like I feel like I may have turned the CD volume on the mister up. So I'm going to pop up with that menu and fix that real quick. Okay. Because these sound effects are being buried. Yeah, no, you can hardly hear them. Okay. That's... Yeah, that sounds a little bit more on the level. Okay. We got this. I'm gonna put that back at 2x, so that way it's consistent post. <laughs> then again, never mind there. <laughs> I thought about it, and I was like, wait, no, I balanced for the, the CD audio. I didn't balance for PCM sound. Right. So right now, Bob's actually playing on the, uh, the snack adapter for the Mister, which allows you to use, uh, uh, original consoles controllers for it, so he's using a Turbo Graphics controller for better or worse. Yeah, the Turbo Graphics controller is pretty good, honestly. It's, it's neat, for, man. It really needs uh, more buttons. It does. For having only two buttons, it's pretty good. Here's the thing, though. Think about it this way: it technically has four because it has one, two, uh -huh. and then it has run and select. So it has the same number of buttons as the Genesis, pitifully enough. <laughs> Because in this, when you hit select, it actually does your uh, item crash. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'm, not go I'm not going the other way. I don't want to fight the, the okay. snake dragon. I just don't. Sure. <laughs> I, I think this boss is cooler anyways. And the, plus and we the get enemies to fight are the big too. guy. Yeah, exactly. We get to fight China Warriors. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Look at him. China Warrior he might really... be bigger. He might actually. <laughs> <laughs> he really is, like, spot on the same size, though. Like, they're both that huge. Yes. See, Richter, he could be done on Genesis, but China Warrior Man? No. No way. No way. Not this time. Who knows? Maybe they could have done it on the Genesis, but they're all too afraid. <laughs> they're like, no, our, our thing has blast processing. It's about going fast, not being big. That'd be it, stupid. And they were wrong. Just gotta keep doing that. There he goes. Uh, have you moonwalked yet? That's important. Yes, it is. You gotta moonwalk to the next area. That's that's also important. You gotta be like, <laughs> I'm coming for you. I guess I can't. No, nope. <laughs> I need to turn around. It has opinions about which way you look. <gasps> look at the Durgan. That's the worst song in the game. Unfortunately. Oh yes, it's it's ludicrous levels of terrible. I would like to know it is made with the PC Engine hardware. Oh my god. Mood. Look, I have the axe, so I can just keep on, keep on tossing. But yeah, I feel like as far as CD games mm -hmm. from the era, this is probably the best soundtrack on any of them ever. Yeah. Because I can't think of anything that comes close. It doesn't help that a lot of PC, a lot of CD platforms for retro consoles just bombed. Yeah. He's doing fine. The AC's on. His favorite <laughs> song is playing. <laughs> like, he is so easy compared to the other boss. It's hilarious. It's almost like he's the boss of level one. Right. And that other guy isn't. <laughs> yeah. Oh. You're just hanging upside down from those ricks. <laughs> it's seconds before disaster. It's just Rick again <laughs> falls straight down. <laughs> Face first. And the boss just picks you up and drops you until you're dead. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, honestly, don't do the regular pass enough in this game. I, I, I'm really used to going the other way. Yeah, I, I, I'm the same way, and because you know, then you're cool because you took the secret route. But, right. Uh, I, I really enjoy the normal path. Like, I, I, it's just really fun. Like, look at this rain. This is neat. Yeah. We got some parallax going. <laughs> it's very nice. Didn't take any drugs to so not see the rain. <laughs> Didn't what? Didn't take any drugs to not see the rain, so it's great. <laughs> I hope you guys watched Giving Haze a Chance. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that game. Yeah, man. The sooner I forget, the better I am. <laughs> god. That is so unhinged. Um, man, we wouldn't have fought an axe armor the other way, I don't think. 
Uh, eventually I think you would have. Oh, creepy eyes. Yeah, you don't fight this half of a minotaur thing. You know, this weird beast that chases you. Yeah, and you get to play the original Castlevania 1 intro level. And that's why it's playing the classic music. Yeah. Doo -doo. I'm, I'm broken. I'm damaged. I'm damaged goods. I'm like, oh, really? Yeah, oh, really? <laughs> no yeah. way! It, it's bad. <laughs> that man has done so much more damage than he ever could have imagined. <laughs> yes. <laughs> that's how I climbed the stairs. <laughs> yes, obviously. Any other way would just be too weak. D d fair enough. Uh, is that actually good? Uh, you're dealing with the bat. Okay. No, you're right. Actually, wait, no, you're dealing with the, with the uh, werewolf, so the, the holy water would have been okay, but the axe is good, too. Yeah, because he goes on the walls yeah, and stuff. Yeah, he goes on the walls and stuff. God, this soundtrack is just so good. Yeah, it's unreal. This is not fair to anything else. <laughs> hey, buddy, how's it going? No! This is going great. Oh, man. It was going you so well. You should try whipping. <laughs> Never. I'm a pacifist. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Bye. Yeah, he doesn't uh, burst into flames when you touch the door. You yeah, gotta, he has to do this thing. You have to fully escape this man. Then his head just falls off. This is how I feel crawling into bed some days, you know? I'm just so tired. <laughs> just uh, The act of getting into bed, my upper body just snaps off and I burst into flames. <laughs> my girlfriend's very annoyed by this. And that's how you know we're not playing Castlevania Chronicles. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, does it... Is it spews like, no. bats. Oh my god, it does. Yeah, that was hilarious. I lost it. Every time I hit that thing in a Castlevania game nowadays, I'm just like, wait, this isn't the one that does that, right? <laughs> oh, oh, I don't have the key. You didn't get the key. It was probably in the chase, actually. Like, I think that's where it dropped, and I just forgot. It was probably in the what? During the chase. Yeah. That's tragic. I guess uh, Marie isn't there forever. Rip. Is that where Marie is? Mm -hmm. Jesus. Oh, my yep. God. They give you Marie really early on. You don't get that great cutscene. Yeah, that cutscene's that cutscene's real good. But see, it's okay though. In this game, you can go back and retry levels. That's true. It's very unlike other Castlevania games. You don't just have to have one ideal run. You can go do as you please. Yeah, I wish Castlevania Three was like that. Yeah, it'd be great to see them do like a, a cool remake. It feels really weird to me that. That, like, Rondo and 3 are so good, and I feel like Bloodlines isn't, in uh, like, better, objectively. I mean, I, I like Bloodlines a lot, but yeah. I, I do, too. I don't like it as much as this. Just to be, just to be clear, I, I love Bloodlines, but I don't think it's as good as Rondo, and I don't think it's quite as good as 3. 3 has a lot of amazing things with all the custom characters, you know, the different characters. It does. You get it as your teammates. And the music, I think, in 3, especially my, you know, Akumajo <laughs> Densets version is incredible. And I don't think it is as good of a soundtrack as Michiru turned in. Like, Bloodline's soundtrack is really good, though. So it's, it, it is really it, good. I don't think it's as good as 3 on the Japanese cartridge, but just, it is really good. Yeah, I'm sure you got this. You know what? You Just just use Item Crush. You got 73 I hearts. went to hit the button, and uh, yeah. it was in the place I expected it to be because, you know, it's... Yeah. They're a little bit farther than on other controllers. That's a little true. Bit more toward the center. That's that's unfortunate. So I just smash my thumb into plastic. <laughs> and Pop's trying to crush his controller while Werewolf eats him. <laughs> and now I, I don't guess have that, axes. I said. I guess that would have been one advantage to having the holy water. You could have just hit that and then focused on dodging, because oh, you yeah. had seventy-three hearts. You probably could have keep it caught, kept it up most of the fight. Right. That's true. <laughs> that was like a weird hyena version of Sui. <laughs> I used to be able to get this guy no damage. I used to be real good. I used to be the best. <laughs> <laughs> 
so I played, um... Yeah, that helps. Man, that would have really cleared that out the first time. Yeah. Shit, we should have kept the holy water. Pinball. Can you escape the dragon's fury? Oh, no. There we go. One more. Oh! oh! Okay, I got it this time. Yeah. But yeah, my uh, first time playing this game was on a bad emulator, so it felt like crap. Uh-huh. And I thought that was just how the game felt. Right. Uh, did not realize, nope, that is uh, just good old-fashioned em emulator input lag. <sighs> then I played the PSP version, which was a lot better than that. Mm-hmm. And then eventually I got a Turbo Graphics. Played it on that, it was, like, really incredible. And now you can play it on the Mister. Great. And, and it's pretty great. Oh. I was thinking about it, and I was like, if you get a PlayStation Vita TV that covers PSP, PS1 in great quality with the Sharp Scale mod, then get a PS2 with some sort of hard drive attachment. Oh, oh man. In a oh Mister. And most your retro setup that you need nowadays is there. Oh, just whip him! Yeah. Okay, dodge. Oh, oh man. That was almost really bad. That was ridiculous. It's, oh. it's time I mention again that uh, I really appreciate on retro consoles how clean the sound is because there's no compression on the audio. Mm -hmm. Like, audio samples are compressed, but the audio itself isn't compressed. So you get a lot more dynamic range. See, this is CD quality audio. This sounds better than any game on a modern <laughs> platform soundtrack-wise. <laughs> yeah. The, the chasm between the quality of this audio right now and what you would get coming out of a... Uh, like, say, Astral Chain. Uh-huh. Which, like most modern games, is compressed to hell. Is, uh, staggering. Yeah, no, it's weird to think about. Yeah, it's it's just a shame audio quality has gone down over the years because more affordable quality headphone hardware, you know, it's gotten a lot more affordable. Can he do it? I was like, can you cheese through this? I don't remember. I think, but the question is, is it even worth it? Right. Don't forget to extend, Bob. Yeah, I, I was trying to do that, but I, I'm bad at it. Must extend. I guess that is it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> it just gives you that little bit. Yeah, it's like a hey, tiny bit more. In some situations, that can turn the tide. Yes, for sure. That's what you wanted, right? Yeah, definitely. Well, good. <laughs> like, well, it started. I can't expect meat. I would have liked more hearts, though. <laughs> Man, ah. it's, it's a real shame that NEC messed up bringing over the turbo graphics. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's, it's like Hudson. really tragic. Yeah, yeah. It's, I, I think it would have been nice to have a third strong player in the uh, yeah, console that, market that'd be earlier. Really, that would be really great. Um, it's also a shame that they couldn't figure out how to make a successor to this platform. Right. They kept making attachments and upgrade cards and stuff. And we know how that goes for everyone. <laughs> uh, yes, we do. And I don't know how they couldn't have seen that coming, but they didn't. No. Of course not. Yes, one heart. You know, I bet the Super NES would have done sweeps if it had back and pat. I feel like if they had effective back and pat with NES titles. I was like, Super NES still did really well, right? Uh, the Genesis knocked its teeth out in North America. Oh. But eventually, the Super NES caught up. Uh, especially worldwide, I think they were neck and neck. Okay. Keep in mind, in Japan, Super NES sells. In right. Japan, the Mega Drive does nothing. Of course. Basically. PC Engine, however... Check. PC Engine outsold the Super NES at one point, which is really funny. <laughs> yeah, no, it's... It would have been really interesting to see them continue forward. Yeah. I mean, at least we got Sony in the market. Yeah, That helps right. things. We aren't just stuck with... Just Nintendo and Sega. Right. Yeah, that would have been terrible. You saw how badly Sega botched. I mean, the Saturn was supposed to be a 2D system until they saw the, the PS1, I believe, and then they added the secondary processor to do 3D. 
I can just walk on this and it doesn't yes, quit, right? Yes, correct. Okay. It's only if you jump on it that it messes up, or if you get knocked back onto it. Right. Yeah, no. You were thinking about it, though? I was thinking about it. It I mean, would stop these Medusas from stop killing Medusa you. Medusa heads. Which, you know, they're a real problem. Oh, that didn't... I guess it wouldn't stop them. Jesus, isn't that That's I'm a good idiot. thing we stopped the Medusa heads. What an idiot I am. <laughs> God, my walk of shame down here. <laughs> it's like, here you go, loser. You, you leave through this door. And it's just a doggy door. <laughs> yes. It's not even a normal human sized door. <laughs> Richter's like, fine, but I don't like this. The moths are so cool. Yeah, it's such a nice touch. No. I did. I saw the bones. I didn't see the fire that he was shooting up higher. Yeah. I, yeah. Didn't expect it. No. Oh, hey, an axe. Oh my god! Nice. Eight, two hits immediately. <laughs> but yeah, I feel like the major shortcoming of the system, from my experience, is that controller's not great, and the North American design is huge. Yeah. What were they thinking? I don't know. Were they? I don't know. I like how strong the axes are. Oh, yeah. And how free and huge they are. Yeah. It's real great. Really great. Lots of Castlevania games, they, they err on the other side. In fact, uh, Dracula XX... I believe they're just worse. Of course. I think they might still be huge, but their damage is worse, I'm pretty sure. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe this is just how I felt playing it, but... Right. Game's like, what are you doing? And you're like, pecking? Praying? Yeah, basically. <laughs> no. Okay. I understand. <laughs> okay, I'll leave. Whoa! There we go. Yeah. There we go. You know what I like about this game? What's that? You jump up and push forward in midair, you do like this tiny inch forward. Yes, it's really nice. It's the neutral jump. Yeah, that's important. More games should have that. Not a fan of games not having that. Yeah. I understand the, the point of the... Committed jump. Right, but I feel like having a... I jump where I can still give, do a slight adjustment there. Yes. Is really nice. Yeah, I wish, uh... I wish Ghost of Goblins had that. Yes. <laughs> if Ghost of Goblins wants to hurt you, so no. And that's true. It doesn't care about my feelings. <laughs> yes. I, uh... I have to wonder how, Got him. how much the community... Yeah, though, they explode at doors, so that's fine. <laughs> Uh, I have to wonder how much the community, the, the Ghosts and Goblins community, appreciates or does not appreciate, uh, the PC Engine port, like that really fancy one that's using, like, the arcade core. Oh, I didn't realize it existed. I haven't booted it up in a while. In fact, now I'm struggling to think, did I even boot it up? Get out of my chair. Okay. <laughs> Sit. <laughs> Ego played this game, and he's like, that's weird. Why can't I sit in the chair? <laughs> that was the first thing he said when he came over to make Castlevania games. He's like, make these chairs sittable. <laughs> oh, no. This needs to be fixed right now. I'll have fun with this dude. Yes. He's, uh, he's not a fan of you. Very purple. Well, His uh, axe deflects yeah, it. Yeah, it did. His lower body doesn't, though. Uh-oh. He's jumping. I didn't think he'd head all the way up there. He's a big boy. Oh my god. <laughs> it 
These sound effects are so good. Oh man, you shook loose and then he could damage you again. Oh man, oh. that attack's always hard to dodge. Yeah, it is. It's everywhere. I think that was my last life. Okay, no. Uh, yep, now you're on your last life. Not a good look. No. So I'm struggling to remember, if you don't have a sub weapon, uh -huh. in this one, when you use item crash, does it just permanently make your whip fire? I think it just lets you do one fire whip attack. Okay. I thought it. there was a difference between Dracula XX and this one. I thought Dracula XX did that, and this one has proper fire whip. Maybe... I don't think so, but maybe. Okay. We're gonna hit him with the item crash as soon as he gets out. <laughs> sure. You better make sure he's hittable, though. Yeah. Yeah, he's hittable. Oh, right. It was all over the screen anyway. I didn't need to do that. Yeah, it's not It's not the Super NES one where it just shoots out a bunch and bounces them around. I was actually thinking the Symphony one. Where it's like around. Uh, yeah, it spins around the giant cross. Yeah. Right. The Grand Cross. God. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Trying to remember if it was uh, Chronicles, as in the X68 cave uh, Castlevania game that has the first boss that we go. Yeah, that's a JoJo's. <laughs> yeah, Grand Cross is actually in that Dragon Quest manga. Yeah, Feel keeps bringing that up. <laughs> But that's what got me thinking about it. <laughs> well, hopefully he doesn't do anything crazy like charge you and need to be backflipped over. Oh, well, I survived your final attack. That's fine. See, that dodging it wouldn't be true strength. You're totally right on that, Bob. <laughs> yeah. Do a flip. No, we're going to do the, the whip. And I'm actually going to hit it. Yeah. Yeah. Do, 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 do. I think we could do one more level. You could do this in one life, right? Yeah, definitely. I got this. It's just stage four. This one's easy, right? Sometime I need to get the English translation version of this. The, the fan patch. Oh, that's not the axe. No. No, it is not. This is also very Castlevania one. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Whew, okay. <laughs> Jesus. Sometimes there's your sicko mode. There we go. <laughs> or as the Joker would say, normal mode. <laughs> yeah, that, that skeleton just decided to be pretty normal right then. <laughs> God. That joke is the dumbest thing since they... Here's the novel thought, you getting some pinches. <laughs> This is like a boss. Yeah. Yeah. Bob beat the boss on one life. Good job, Bob. Yeah. Oh, no. Good job, Bob. It's fine. I didn't want those hearts. It's. I still think it's hilarious. You can slide in uh, the bloodstained plastic mode. So you just go under the bone dragons like that. Oh, yeah. No, that is really funny. I need to play more of that. Yeah, that was me, a lot of fun. Me and Vox need to do a race on that. Wait, he's not dead. Why did he do that? There. Uh, because he was hitting a switch. I think the switch came up while he was doing that. Oh, no. Fine. <laughs> it... <laughs> There's a tr booby trap here for arrows. Bob likes to call out uh, game design decisions before <laughs> he tr triggers them to show them off, so that way you can all appreciate them. <laughs> I don't know if this way is actually easier. I just always go this way because it's how you unlock something in this, the PSP version. Yeah, there's something. There's some cool designs this way, like that. What the hell? <sighs> that was that was pretty tight. Go away. <laughs> I always thought that sound in the right channel. That do 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 do. Wah, wah. Part of the song, it just it makes like a whack sound in the right channel exclusively over and over in this song. And I always thought that was like somebody put a bad upload on the internet because it sounds like early MP3 glitches. 
<laughs> and then when I got to the game and it's like, oh no, it actually just sounds like that. That's unfortunate. <laughs> right. <laughs> it's a very rhythmic problem with this MP3. <laughs> oh no. Uh oh. Okay. I, I like that Richter's like, no, I have to walk. I'm not, I, I will not deal with walk, moving any faster. Well, yeah, <laughs> that's, that's Maria's thing. She can crawl, she can move fast. He'll leave that to her. Oh, wait, no, he'll leave her in a cell. Yes, we've been over this. <laughs> Unfortunately. Yeah. <laughs> Uh-oh. Is that a good switch or a bad switch? Oh, no, it was definitely not worth dying for. No. Oh no! no! Did I get enough points to get another life? Yes. Okay, okay that's good. That's good. <laughs> Axe is a little bit better than the cross in this one. Yeah, no, I'm definitely missing it. No! Oh. No. Yeah, I knew it. Oh, this is Infinite Fleeman. Yeah, the Fleeman bu bu button. At least they die when they hit the spikes. That's right. helpful. Yes. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, man. <laughs> that was a little close. Yeah. You should whip that uh, pillar. Maybe there's... No? No. Oh. oh. And then the right, and then the middle. Dang it. Oh, no. That dude's gonna hit you with a spray fireball. A stray fireball, even. Huh. Yeah, there's definitely a... a oh. A pattern here, but, uh... That guy's hanging out, makes it risky. Yeah.